Hi, Dad! We're all your children. We came from your semen. Semen. <laughs> semen. Ha-ha! <laughs> oh, sorry. Wrong house. Look, Eddie's at the wrong house. Ha-ha! 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 They're my kids and they all look like me. Doesn't mean we have anything in common. I've never felt proud of any of my children until now. I don't understand, Chris. Your blind date should be here by now. She answered the ad. Whoa. Now we'll never know what's behind the last box on the M&M advent calendar. It's M&M's, Peter. They've all been M&M's. You don't know that! You ate my whole family, you fat bastard. One more day. Oh! <sighs> Coach is a bum. Oh, bloody hell! <laughs> Beetle Bailey. <laughs> oh, that's it. All right, fat man. Two can play at that game. <clears throat> ah, friendly fire! Oh, my God, they've opened fire. All right, looks like things are getting very heated here. This is not a safe place to be. And now sports. Next. No, you're not supposed to be in the house, Brian. You're more of an outdoor dog. What the hell does that mean? This is so humiliating. For God's sake, I went to Brown, and he's got me out here tied to a post like some kind of... <laughs> what the hell? This rope was a lot longer, and now it's somehow gotten shorter. What sort of black magic is this? I want some ice cream. No, Peter, you finish your food. You... Hey, you, you get back here right now, mister. Don't, don't you... Get down from that chair or you're in big trouble. You... You put that ice cream back right now. I mean it. I am not kidding around. I am not gonna say it again. Uh, if you put that ice cream in your mouth, you're gonna be in big trouble, young man. D you... Huh? Huh? <laughs> I hate you! I hate you! I want my mommy! Well, I'm the best you've got! I told her I have a dog, so... Would you pretend to be my dog? Oh, well, well, well. Well, well, well. Well, well, well. Brian, come on, I'm serious. Will you help me out? Glenn Quagmire, there are not enough tennis balls in the world for me I to... I have six. I'll do it. Greg the Weather Mime. Okay, it's going to be cold. Very cold. And, and, and there's going to be wind. And people's parents will throw fecal matter down on them from the rooftops. How awful! Oh, no, I'm, I'm sorry. That's, that's rain. Y yes. It'll rain. My God, I still can't believe they wore each other's underwear. Like, can you imagine? I know, right? Like, icky times a thousand. Hey, this is crazy. But what if we wore each other's underwear just for a joke? What? No, that's a terrible idea. Nah, just, just joking. He's so stupid! Can I be done now? I don't know what happened. I told the doctor C cups. I told him something else. Detention kids are scary. Especially that fourth grader writing on the board. Oh, that is such a load of truth. A wonderful load of truth. Been special. In high school, he didn't play sports, but he did wear a helmet. <laughs> <laughs> You know, Peter, I love your chin, but I gotta ask, what's it like going through life with a scrotum so close to your mouth? You know what? Hold on, I'll just ask your teenage daughter. <laughs> you know, Peter's challenging the stereotype of Irish guys being fat, drunk, and stupid by throwing a little gay in there, too. <laughs> oh, nice. Homophobia. Peter's got a small penis, but hey, nothing grows in the shade. The song we call Mommy and Daddy's Room, and we think it's one you can all relate to. Everybody's gone to sleep And you've said goodnight, Moon There's plenty of noise still coming From Mommy and Daddy's room Oh, Daddy says please Mommy says no Daddy says come on Mommy says whoa Daddy goes uh Mommy goes ow Daddy says I'm done Mommy goes wow Daddy, Daddy rolls over and falls asleep Mommy drinks wine in the dark
but she said she never wants to see me again. Well, I'm sure you can come up with some excuse to see her at the vet. Is there any more coffee? Anna, I'm here with my dog. He's not feeling well. Fuck you. But she said she never wants to see me again. Well, I'm sure you can come up with some excuse to see her at the vet. Is there any more coffee? Anna, I'm here with my dog. He's not feeling well. Fuck you. So, um, how do you like working at the vet? Oh, it is so rewarding. Ever since I was a little girl, I have loved working with animals. Did you ever make it with one of the dogs? What? I mean, uh, uh, did you enjoy your appetizer? It hasn't come yet. Oh, um, I mean, did you ever make it with one of the dogs? No, stupid! We're gonna be happy again. I know how you feel, son, but you can't give up now. Now let's get out there and meet some ladies, eh? But I don't want to date anyone else. I want Anna. Chris, you don't want to miss out on experience in your teenage years. If you do, you'll feel as bad as I do when I miss the toilet. I don't understand, Chris. Your blind date should be here by now. She answered the ad. Whoa. I don't understand, Chris. Your blind date should be here by now. She answered the ad. Whoa. I said I was loco. Loco. Si. Muy loco. Well, I can be loco. I have a teardrop tattoo on my cheek. Where? I don't see it. N not that cheek. Peter, that's an unwiped watermelon seed. Loco? No. Hi, I've got my gun here. I'd like to rent a stall, please. Sure. You need a tutorial before you start? <laughs> yeah, it's a gun range. I think I got it. Wait! I think I did it wrong! So how was the gun range, Dad? Did you shoot up that silhouette real good? <laughs> that is so my dad. Stewie, she's got your time machine. But don't drag that down the stairs or... <laughs> Thank God, everything's back to normal. Two, Gross. That's what any guy wants. The same gal again and 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 again. And every gal wants the same guy who keeps getting fatter and fatter and fatter and fatter. Stop it right there, Lois. This is Family Guy. We only do the male side of the joke. I've never told you that I can't throw a boomerang, but it's true. See? I told you. That's what any guy wants. The same gal again and 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 again. And every gal wants the same guy who keeps getting fatter and fatter and fatter and fatter. Stop it right there, Lois. This is Family Guy. We only do the male side of the joke. Close dancing, 12 o'clock. Hey! Arms link, dirty porno lovers! So, going stag tonight, Meg? Oh, no. I brought someone. Hello, I'm in love with Meg. Well, now I'm very sorry I asked. On and on about how I should be mayor. And it's got me thinking, it is an interesting idea. You think I should do it? Absolutely not. I mean, if not me, who? Anyone. If not now, when? Never. You know, why not me? A million reasons. I mean, who do you want in there? Some career politician? Yes. What are they gonna do? Govern. Thanks, Dewey. Your support means a lot. You don't have it. You know what? I'm gonna do it. Guys, I have an announcement. I'm gonna run for mayor. That's a terrible idea. You idiot, Brian. Meg, fat on Brian. I can't. I don't have one in the chamber. And one time I give you a chance, you're not ready. Chris, tag in for Meg. I want you to meet my new girlfriend. New girlfriend? Yeah. You remember that girl Lindsay I told you about? Well, I asked her out and now we are dating. Hey. Oh my god. My goodness, look at you. Do you even realize who you look like? Cameron Diaz, that's who. You are gorgeous. Well, she's awful pretty, I know that, Mom. Are you kidding me? Are they not seeing this? I know, it's kind of creepy. It's almost like he's dating Lois. Yeah, looks like somebody's getting a little edit. Can we say that? Just did. <gasps> Bo Peep! What, what's going on here? Um...
You've got a friend in me? Also, you can have my penis enlarging machine. It's in my closet. Ah, did you look? Will you, will you text me if you looked? Me too, but who cares? You should never be afraid to be different. Who? Who? Whom? Grandpa, I don't even want the money. See? This is exactly why you should get it. So refreshing. Well, I, I don't want it either. Good, because you're not getting it. Come on, what are you doing? Listen, Carter, you take me out of your will, I'm taking you out of mine. Peter, that wasn't your will. That was your birth certificate. Oh, no. <gasps> There's no light. There's only fire. 9-11 was bad. <laughs> I agree with that. God, I can't believe how easy this is. Mrs. Griffin, what are your plans for cleaning up our environment? 9-11. Mrs. Griffin, what about our traffic problem? 9-11. Peter Griffin's search history. Winnie the Pooh. Winnie the Pooh jacket. Winnie the Pooh vintage jacket. Winnie the Pooh letterman jacket. Winnie the Pooh windbreaker. Eeyore jacket, Eeyore vintage jacket, Eeyore letterman jacket, lactating pregnant Latinas, wow, huge turn there, piglet pencil erasers, okay, getting back in there, full cast Winnie the Pooh backpack, oh, cancer symptoms, yeah, coughing up blood, pain in abdomen, Winnie the Pooh casket, yeah, he is sick. All right, whip them out, woman. It's time for the afternoon meal. My goodness, Dewey. I guess you're hungry. Oh, honey, not so rough this time. Mommy's very sore. And by the way, let's be clear. I only like you as a friend. Now, before we begin, I want you to know the record is just past my watch. Well, it takes two people to break a record. You look a little young. How old are you? Uh, 13? 14? 15? But, but he didn't force himself on me. I wanted it too. Well, that's the important thing. Well, that's odd. Your vagina seems to have a penis and two testicles. Oh, right. I, uh, sneezed real hard and all that came out. Ah, that explains it. Could you do that thing where you take some fluid and tell me if it's going to be an imbecile or a cretin? Oh, not to worry. There are places where those people can be warehoused. Come on, man. Which one is Peter Griffin? Uh, this is Peter Griffin. <laughs> hey, that's a good one. <laughs> Why are you... No, wait. I'm not finished holding my sides. <laughs> Why are you... <laughs> Why... <laughs> I was able to remove his tumor. And if anyone wants to keep it, it's here in this Tupperware. This, this is half of a chicken cutlet. Oh, boy. What did I have for lunch? He's going to have to undergo dialysis treatments three times a week. Dialysis? Is there any other way? Yes, there is. No, 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 no. Wait, wait, wait. We'll, we'll do the dialysis. You've got a lot to learn in a short amount of time, like a fruit fly. All right, son. I'm your dad. There's your mom. This is your house. You like fruit, and we're all dead. Hey, now, what the hell are you doing? First, it's not Peter. When I am in this outfit, I am Maxi Patty, the fiercest enemy of heavy flow. Peter, you look... Okay, that's clever. But, Peter, you look ridiculous. It is such that the recipient can physically shrink in stature. That's why husbands and wives are the same height in old age. Do it. For starters, you're a failure. Ah! You didn't go to college, Daddy pays our mortgage, and you're a terrible husband and father. Ouch! Your whole life is a pattern of hateable noises. Oh. The way you chew a banana makes it sound like it's filled with bones. Ouch. Appearance. <laughs> Intelligence. <laughs> Penis size. <laughs> and another thing. Well, Lois, you are a master. Pulse. I can save him, but we gotta move fast. Give me 20 cc's of music factory. Clear. Everybody dance now. Again. Clear. Everybody dance now. Clear. Everybody dance now. You did it. Great work. Don't thank me. Thanks, silly 90s songs. What do we got? Head injury. He got knocked down. We'll get him up again. I need two milligrams of chumba and one of wumba. Four vertebrae.
So, uh, I guess this means, Peter, you're our Joe now, and Joe, you're our Peter. That means you gotta do anything for ten bucks. Okay. I have a request. Yay! Joe's chin! Oh, she's so cute. Can I keep her? Eh, I don't know. Can she set up a cutaway? Can I help you? And just like that, the Griffins have a cat. I don't know. I, I just, I can't stand how everyone buys into this annual mass hypnosis. I mean, like, do not even get me started on Christmas caroling. No, go ahead. I'm listening. No, that's, that's what I mean. I do not get me started. Trust me, you, you will be here all night. I've got time. I'm officially getting you started. Name one thing. Whew, I mean, where do I start? Like, the, the things I have to say about caroling, it's like, how long have you got? I've got all night. No one to go home to. Let's hear it. Yeah, okay. Well, if, I mean, first, there's the, you know, the singing. Eh. You know what? Screw you guys. As they look. <gasps> Gerald! <laughs> the secret is in the frosting, but I'll never tell. Oh, good. Kids, you're just in time for breakfast. No time, Mom. The girl I stalk has field hockey practice at 8. I love a red-cheeked barbarian. How about you, Meg? Can't. I'm weirdly the girl he's stalking. God help me, I love the attention. Well, it's just you and me, Stewie. What should we do today? I don't know, maybe forget everything that just happened? I'm good at getting rid of evidence. Peanut, were you masturbating? <laughs> Prove it. I'm looking for a car that's been tricked out to look like an ice cream truck. Damn it. I'm, I'm sorry, what? You know, with colorful pictures of ice cream treats. And it plays a tune that's fun for the young children. Da 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 Hey there, little fella. We sure got a lovely day for it, don't we? Stay away from my brother's butt. Now, that one seemed less um. If you hit it just right, I'll poop and burp at the same time. It's called a boop. That's how Betty Boop got her name. Boop, 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 boop. <coughs> Oops. What happened? I was breastfeeding Stewie and he bit me again. I think he might have even broken his skin. I see. Um, maybe I should, uh, you know, uh, look at it. Uh, I, uh, I, I have seen a lot of medical shows. You see, the areola is very tender here, and I think one of his new teeth may have bitten down right on the duct. I'm sorry, what? I don't know what to do, Brian. Breastfeeding's just so painful since Stewie's teeth are coming in. No problem. Uh, any, any other problems you have, too, like, for example, ar around your underpants that you want me to take a look at? I could, I could take a look at, at, at that, too. Huh? Peanut, were you masturbating? Prove it. I'm trying to help you. Help me what? Clean your pool with my shirt off? Or wash your car in jean shorts? Bend over in front of you to get little bits of lint out of the rug? I know what you're about, Mr. Herbert. Free labor, and I'm not into it. The owl and the pussycat went to sea in a beautiful pea-green boat. They took some honey and plenty of money wrapped up in a five-pound note. The owl looked up to the stars above and sang to a small guitar, Oh, lovely pussy, oh, pussy, my love, what a beautiful pussy you are, you are... Where has this book been all my life? What a beautiful pussy you are... I'll be right back. Hey, Cleveland, come on in. Surprise! 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 What the hell's he doing? Sorry, Cleveland. He wanted a surprise party, and this is how he thinks it works. Surprise! Surprise! Ooh, the very horny caterpillar. Wow. Did you eat through all that food? Kinda. Why you're complaining? I'm the one who's about to get violently bisected by the woodsman. What woodsman? <laughs> You know, I'm not sure if that's our hero or just a lunatic going house to house murdering people. <laughs> yeah, he, he just did it again. I think we should 
I think we should call somebody. Oh, God. Delete. History. No! No! Wow, you dropped the big one, huh? Hiroshima, you're like a hero. Well, I don't know about that. Oh, I can't imagine killing 300,000 people. Do you know how many 300,000 people is? Fill, like, six football stadiums, then just kill them all, you know? And, and not only that, but what people forget is you ruin millions of lives on top of that. It's, it's, it's like you were saying, not only am I going to kill you, but you can't live here anymore. Hardcore, man. Mom, you remember that goldfish we flushed down the toilet? He wasn't dead. Help! I'm supposed to have surgery, but my doctor disappeared. Okay, Josh. This is the shot you've been waiting for. Okay, Derek. This is the shot you've been waiting for. I had him pump my stomach, too. Doc, what was in there? Well, it's a pretty extensive list. I'm gonna need Billy Joel to help me out. Lots of Legos, rubber bands, web shooting, Spider-Man, an old pet rock, an antique clock, a ton of red play-doh. Colored pencils, lots of nickels, half a jar of plastic pickles, banjo strings, chicken wings, a single by kilo. I didn't poop those items. They were in my tummy, cause they all look yummy. He didn't poop those items. He tried to eat them, so you shouldn't feed him. I feel like they're clutter. I feel like you don't need them. But let's just see what you look like without... Whoa! You kids are Legos? I'm sorry you had to find out this way, Mom. We did it! We found the treasure! You know what, Peter? Why don't you open it? Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, okay, I'll, I'll, I'll open it. Here, hold this. Oh, really, Lois? I thought I might drive forward. I thought that, that might be a fun thing to do. Chris, the way to eat an Oreo is to twist it, pull it apart, and lick it. Now you. Hey, Peter, who are these guys? Oh, this is just my looping gif of black teens reacting to a very mild burn. Huh, sounds kind of pointless. Oh, you mean like your feet? <gasps> Oh, my God! Holy crap! Oh, man, Joe is gonna be so pissed! Thank God all we hit were those trash cans. Oh, my God! Oscar! Uh, tell my ex-wife... to go herself. Boy, this is more awkward than having sex with a rhinoceros who doesn't love you anymore. Why wouldn't you look at me during... <laughs> Hi. So, I told you about 10 minutes ago, something's wrong with 14. Yep, somebody's working on it, sir. Dad, what's going on? This sucks! I want to go home! Please, my wife's out of town. I... I don't know what else to do. You have to help me. You have 
to help me right now. Should just be another couple minutes. Dad, Tyson spilled fruit punch on me. No, I didn't. Dad. <sighs> No. Oh, he's gonna hate me for changing this one. Hello? Stewie? Ryan, is my mouse in my butt? Yeah, my mouse in my butt. You've gotta fix this! I'm trying! Ryan, where's my butt? No. 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 Ryan, you did it! No. Oh, sh Sorry. Peter, I think Lois might be having a midlife crisis. Dudes, who wants to hop in my wheels and head to the beach for some ultimate frisbee? Yeah, Sheldon, I'm with you. I can't... I can't do that. I said I was loco. Loco. Si. Muy loco. Well, I can be loco. I have a teardrop tattoo on my cheek. Where? I don't see it. No, not that cheek. Peter, that's an unwiped watermelon seed. Loco? No. Hey, Meg, will you hold this for Daddy? Okay. Why? Uh, it's a present. It's a thanks for being such a sweetie watermelon. So you'll hang on to that? Yeah, sure. Yeah. This is weird. Am I supposed to eat this? <laughs> I hate you! I hate I've never told you that I can't throw a boomerang, but it's true. See? I told you. This is packed. How are we gonna figure out who has your credit card? I got it, Brian. Smell my ass. What? Smell my ass. It's where I keep my wallet. Get the scent and then find the guy that smells like me. Peter, that's ridiculous. Come on, boy. Get the uh, scent. Cut, cut, cut it out. Stop, stop it. Stop. Oh, God, that's disgusting. You're an idiot. You know that? Wait, wait a minute. <laughs> your wallet's over there. <laughs> what? What? I do not laugh like that. Again, Brian, I'm you. I can't do it unless you've already done it. You can't do it unless I've already done it? What is this, Bark to the Future? Uh, uh, uh. Stewie! What? I have to tell you about the future! What? I have to tell you about the future! On the night, I go back! Wait, 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 no, 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 H hang on, Michael. I have to tell you about your future. I say, as Americans, we should all take a pledge to kick him out. Only pledge I stand for is Lemon Pledge. All right, past, here I come. Wow, everybody in 1955 was on fire. If I'm gonna disappear into nothing, I might as well bang my mom. Hey, Lorraine, wait up! Hi, my name's Marty. I'm in a picture. You gonna beat up my husband? Unless he American chicken. Did you just call me chicken? Yes, chicken. Fikray, fikray, fikray. Sound different than Russia. Nobody calls me chicken. Outside now. Hi, we're from Publishers Clearinghouse. I have a million dollar check for someone named Chicken. <gasps> a conflict. She is smiling alone. You kids are too young to remember that, but your parents are gonna hate it. Let's make sure we're not goaded into fights by simple playground taunts. Damn, I was hoping for Chicken. Nobody calls me Chicken. Peter, no! I'm no different than my peers. Rosa Parks, Nelson Mandela, Dr. Martin Luther King. Hey, did you ever notice he has the names Doc and Marty in his name? Let it go. Hello, Twitter. I've had a really stressful morning. Wait a minute, Doc! Are you telling me that it's 825? Precisely! Damn! The power of love. Oh, 
Oh, you out of time, baby. Rufus Griffin star. You don't have to be formal with me. I know how you young people talk. Peter, I'm not old, but I'm not that young either. Brian, we should sip Bacardi like it's your birthday. What does that even mean? It means that this damn thing doesn't work at all! Hello. If you're watching this, it means they didn't cut the rope when I climaxed. As a result, I'm now dead. That's not it. If you're watching this one, it means the train wasn't able to push the DeLorean up to 88 miles per hour, and I'm still stuck in 1885. What happens to us in the future, Doc? It's your kids, Marty. Something's got to be done about your kids. What do you mean? Your daughter marries a black man. Th that's actually not a big deal for me. Yeah, me neither. What? Uh, what? Uh, you? Really? Yeah, I mean, well, what's what's wrong with that? Uh, no, no, nothing. Nothing. It's nothing. I guess. I think. I think it's great. Congratulations. I don't think I'm comfortable around you anymore. Did you know peanut butter was invented by a black man? Too late, Doc. We talking Marty Mix Superfly, big. Marty, I want to be your fine, sweet-ass bitch. Damn! Brother Don kissed his mama! Oh, yeah. Get me Isaac Hayes. Isaac, you know that new sound you've been looking for? Well, listen to this. A time machine. Well, sure, here's where the flux capacitor goes. We don't need money. I'm sorry, the bed's breaking up. What? Wait a minute. This is how it ends? Well, there's so many questions left unanswered. Are you Luke Skywalker? Yeah. I've got something for you. A letter. Dear Luke, if my calculations are correct, you should receive this letter at the exact moment the DeLorean vanished. I have been living happily for the past six months in the year 1885. The lightning bolt that... <gasps> 1885?! The Doc's alive! Uh, can I help you? Are you Brian Griffin? Yes. I'm from the Vatican, and this is for you. What is it? The Vatican has been holding this note for you for about 500 years. It was left to us by Leonardo da Vinci himself, with instructions that it be delivered to you on this exact date at this exact time. What's that thing he's on? It's a chair with wheels! He's an absolute dream! You're being played for a fool, like George McFly. Hey, Lorraine. Whatever happened to that guy, Marty, from high school? Don't know. Never saw him after the prom. Really? Sure you didn't run into him, oh, say, about 16 years ago? George, what are you talking about? I'm talking about the fact that our son, who you insisted we name after that guy, Marty, looks exactly like him. You think I'm an idiot? That I wouldn't notice that our son is a dead ringer for the guy who fixed us up? Mom, Dad, I accidentally set fire to the living room rug. I am not going easy on him. Hey, buddy, I need to borrow this. What? I do not laugh like that. Again, Brian, I'm you. I can't do it unless you've already done it. You can't do it unless I've already done it? What is this, bark to the future? Uh, uh, uh. Stewie! What? I have to tell you about the future! What? I have to tell you about the future! On the night, I go back! Wait, 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 no, 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 H hang on, Michael. I have to tell you about your future. Uh, uh, no thank you. I, I just had it clean. No, uh, ah, uh, jeez. Oh, All set, sir. Uh, I, I don't have any change. Sorry. Oh, well, that's okay. No charge. 
Oh, wait, wait, wait. Uh, yeah, you, you hungry? Because, uh, you know, my, my, my wife makes us beefaroni casserole out of this world. Boy, this is worse than the time I was sus. Oh, yeah, it was definitely green. Boy, let me tell you, he was eyeing that drip the whole time. Caught him in the act. I chose brown because it's the color of poo. Let me try. <sighs> Yummy. Watch this. <laughs> like the movie The Ring. Awesome. Ah! Come back here, you. Ah! Giggity, giggity, crabbity, giggity. Hi, I ran away from home. Do you mind if I live with you? Live with me? My goodness, I feel like I'm gonna pinch myself to see if I'm dreaming. Hot dog, it's real. Well, I've still got to do a little work on it. What's it called? Susie. Wow, a song named after a girl. There aren't a million of those already. Name 20. Rosanna, Roxanne, Michelle, Allison, Sarah, Angie, Brandy, Mandy, Gloria, Cecilia, Maggie Mae, Jessica, Nancy, Barbara, Ann, Billie Jean, Layla, Lola, Polly, Helena, Jenny from the Block. Name six more. Sherry, Laura, Wendy, Maria, Peggy Sue, Minnie the Moocher. Name five more. Tracy, Jean, Jane, Mary Ann, Eleanor Rigby. Go fuck yourself. Down by the shores of the hanky panky where the bullfrogs leap from bank to banky. Oh, how unfortunate. Hi, I ran away from home. Do you mind if I live with you? Live with me? My goodness, I feel like I'm gonna pinch myself to see if I'm dreaming. Hot dog, it's real. Eyes are my best friends. I want you to experience it all with me. You can count on us, Joe. Hey, what'd you do with your old wheelchair? I gave it away. Whee! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> my tulips! You dick. Peter, what do you say we go get some lunch? Not yet, Lois. I've been watching this woman for three hours, waiting for her to turn over. Peter, she knows she untied her bikini. Women don't forget those things. Well, will you go over there and pour a cold drink on her back? No. Will you go over there behind her and yell fire drill? No. Will you go over there and lift her shoulder a little so I can see her nipple? All right, fine. Ho-ho! <laughs> what a slut! Oh, muñequita, I would love to feel your mustache on my mustache. Really? Well, there's a lot more body hair where that came from. Oh, well, then no thank you. Okay, Stewie, let's get that little face washed off, then you can play with your bath toys, huh? No, oh, I hate getting my face washed. Oh, look, it's just Mr. Frog. Hello, Mr. Frog. <laughs> My god, how the hell do I keep falling for that? Now you play with your toys and I'll go get you a nice fluffy towel. Do we? Well, looks like you got some cool bath toys in there. Is it okay if I join you? No! Ah! <laughs> hey, is that my froggy butt clock? Care to place a wager on that? Absolutely. What are the stakes? Okay, if I win and you can't do it, you have to put your nose in Meg's hat and take an eight-second inhale. Okay, and if I win, you have to go online and download that footage of the dancing baby from Ally McBeal, and you have to forward it to all your friends with the message, Oh my God, look what I just found online. Isn't this the funniest thing you've ever seen? So, is it a bet? Yeah, fine. Whoa, whoa, I, I had nothing to do with this. And how did this happen? Well, I'm a platinum member at all the hotel chains, so they probably just saw my name and upgraded us. Well, I don't know if I'm comfortable with this. Well, no problem. Let me call the front desk and see if they can switch us to a room with two beds. Ah, uh, yes, we were wondering if we might be able to switch rooms. Uh-huh. I see, so just a windowless single with no water pressure? No, you know what, it's fine. We're already here. My wife says, no, it's fine, we're already here. Oh, you heard that, okay. Thanks, anyway. But don't get any ideas, because nothing is going to happen between us. You have nothing to worry about. I'll be more of a gentleman than John Wayne Bobbitt with his second wife. Hey, honey, would you take out the trash? Yes, yeah, absolutely. <sighs> love it, love it. What else? Well, I have been dying to see that new Rebel Wilson movie. I hear she raps, like, a lot. <sighs> Let's just do this. Hey, you sons of bitches! This is Chad! He's my boyfriend! We love each other! We said it and everything! 
<laughs> A little help. Hello, fellow adult. I am clearly above the minimum height requirement and shall now ride your roller coaster for which you are an attendant. Yes, and I will operate this roller coaster as I am an adult who is licensed to do so. Hey! Oh no! It's the manager! Run! You get out of here, you kids who are just kids and not an adult like me! You'll see, this horse will be a fine addition to our family. You know what? I don't want him to feel self-conscious. Everybody pee. Pee now, we're... Everybody pee now. We're an unusual family. I think you should know these growths on your forearms. They're giant tumors. Yeah, I'm surprised you haven't realized this is not how a human being is supposed to look. And the speech thing and what you're doing with your eye? Uh, you had a stroke about seven years ago. That you've managed to be walking around all this time is nothing short of a miracle. I'd say about two months. Well, well, our little boy is growing up. Come here, Chris, and let's talk about the birds and the bees. Now, imagine the man is this baster, and the woman is this turkey. The man takes his baster and very slowly places it in the turkey. Ew! Does the baster have to go into the dirty, smelly turkey? Why can't it just be with another nice, clean baster? Yellow! Hey, Quagmire! Hey, Peter, what's up? How much? Well, what do you want? Nothing. I'm just called to talk. What you thinking about? What? What do you mean? What am I thinking about? You called me. I just wanted to say hi. So what do you do? I think you should know these growths on your forearms. They're giant tumors. Yeah, I'm surprised you haven't realized this is not how a human being is supposed to look. And the speech thing and what you're doing with your eye? Uh, you had a stroke about seven years ago. That you've managed to be walking around all this time is nothing short of a miracle. I'd say about two months. <gasps> oh, bastard matriarch! She has failed once again to replenish this frigid box with potations. I shall give it a piece of my mind at once. Oh, damn it! Now look here, you... Oh, my God. <gasps> now, you shouldn't be frightened, Stewie. What you saw was actually a very beautiful thing. Well, evidently, madam, you and I differ greatly in our conception of beauty. Because what I just witnessed was ghastlier than a thousand ghouls. Stewie, uh, mummies and daddies like to hug each other that way. In fact, sweetie, that's sort of how you were created. Oh, that is a vile and odious lie. How dare you fill my head with such loathsome propaganda. Get out, you horrid woman. Get out! Okay, honey, I'll go get your teddy bear. Ugh. Oh, good Lord, you saw them together, didn't you? <laughs> you know the tub where you take your little baths? They've done it there, too. Peter, Bonnie says Joe's been really depressed about that robbery. Why don't you go talk to him? Well, I don't know. There's a game on. Shame on you. You march right over there and cheer your old friend up. Don't listen to that, sissy. Grab a beer and watch the game. Yeah, that sounds good. Stop! Oh, my God! Now get your fat ass over to Joe's. Look, buddy, I... I... No! All right, all right, just, all right, just take it easy. Just take it easy, man. Everything's cool. License and registration, please. Oh, I lost my wallet, so I kind of don't have my license. Well, I'm sorry, sir. You know what that means. I don't understand why I gotta do dishes at your house just because I... Keep washing. Seems like more of a restaurant thing. Keep washing! Oh. Beep, beep. Ah, oh, jeez, did I just hit that ostrich? No. Are you sure? Yeah, he's fine. Keep going. Bye, Dad. Don't wait up. Whoa, 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 whoa. Wait a minute. Wait a minute, Lisa. Come back here. You're not going out with all that makeup on. But, Dad... Upstairs, you're a McDonald, not a whore. I love playing pretend. My name's Peter, and I work in the brewery. Now I'm going to put on my pants and go talk to my co-workers that these pants have stool in them. Peter, my God, you look terrible. What happened? I was raped. <laughs> what? Dr. Hartman violated me. He took my innocence. <laughs> What? 
Peter, that's a prostate exam. It's an important part of a physical for men your age. You sound just like him! <laughs> Fucking idiot. Hey, lay out the pieces, find the cockpit, open the glue, take a sniff. <laughs> and this will be my life now. Hey, listen, I'm uh, sorry about Olivia rejecting you. Oh, I haven't given up yet, Brian. She says she wants a more mature, grown-up man, so all I've got to do is be more grown-up. What are you doing? Just cleaning out your brush, man. Hi, Jillian. Hi, Brian. Ready to go? Hey, baby. Hi, Stewie. What the hell are you doing? Eh, not much, really. Just me and my pubes. Hang now. Oh, dear God. Boy, I am so beat from doing adult stuff all day. So am I. I just kind of feel like kicking it tonight. Oh, look at that. I'm growing all the time. Hey, uh, Jillian, can you give me a minute? You ever just let your balls hang out, b Rai? You ever do that, b Roni? Drove my Chevy to the levee, but the levee was bri. Give me my hair back. Ow! What the hell, man? St <laughs> <laughs> Lois, why did you buy this? It was on sale. Is there room for two? <laughs> Hasta la pasam, baby. Only time I lie is when I play poker. It's make or break time. Seventy-five million dollars at stake. Betting starts with Peter Griffin. Oh, he's not looking at much of anything right now. And those mirrored sunglasses? Not doing him any favors. All in. Gotta take this. It's my wife. Are you here? Meow. Purr. Purr. I think you're dreaming. No, I'm not. All right, Joe, let's lose the wheelchair and shoot this thing. Peter, I can't lose the wheelchair. I need it to move. Okay, yeah, but your character can walk. Peter, I'm handicapped. I can't walk. Okay, Chris, roll film and action. Joe, get out of the damn chair. Chris, get the cattle prod. <laughs> okay, now give him some peanut butter so we can make it look like he's talking. You're a dog. Can't you just sniff cancer? No, that's just a myth we started so we could stick our snouts in girls' boobs. <sighs> it's nice to have a clean bill of health. Well, for now. The key is weekly follow-ups. You know, cervical cancer is also a problem. My boyfriend thinks he might have prostate cancer. Nope, doesn't. There's only one thing to do. Shrink down to microscopic size, enter Brian's brain, and destroy the tumor from within. I was raped by a bug. Hi there. Is this the Quahog Mustache Society? Yes, it is. What's the secret password? Mustache. All right, come on in. Point of mustache, the chair recognizes your mustache. Have we discussed what to send Wilford Brimley next month as it is the 70th birthday of his mustache? Oh, I think we just send a nice card. Just make sure it has a mustache on it. Point of mustache, the chair recognizes your mustache. What can we as citizens do about mustache awareness? Good mustache question. We have a new product in our mustache catalog that makes a great stocking stuffer. We call it the Mustache. The slogan is, you mustache your mustache in the mustache. That'll be all for today. Good mustache. Good, Good mustache. mustache. <sighs> I'm already bored. What should we do? Hey, let's prank call Cleveland. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah good idea. Brown house. Uh, Cleveland? It's Loretta. What? But, but you're dead. No, no, I've, I faked my death to get the IRS off my back. Oh, my God. Does that mean I have to give back the insurance money? <laughs> <laughs> Who's there with you, Loretta? <laughs> it's us, you idiot. She's still dead. Oh, you guys are more meaner than the jerky boys. <laughs> oh, that was awesome. There's only one thing to do. Shrink down to microscopic size, enter Brian's brain, and destroy the tumor from within. 
I was raped by a bug. Don't mind me, you guys. I'm just writing a letter to my boyfriend. Dear my boyfriend, thank you for making out with me recently on purpose. That was cool. Those flowers that you totally sent me were really pretty. Just like you said, I am. Love, Meg. Meg, you are so full of crap. You're like those people who sit in Starbucks and publicly write on their laptops. Hey, getting some writing done there, buddy? Yeah, setting up in public so everybody can watch me type my big screenplay. Me too. All real writers need to be seen writing. Otherwise, what's the point, right? You should totally write that down. Okay, will you watch me? Guys, you gotta let us out of here. The real criminal's getting away. Yeah, the bastard's making a break for it, just like South America. Hmm, a lot of black guys over there. Hey, man, where you going? Oh, I'll be back. I'm coming back. I'll be right back. Joe, hold your handcuffs over my lap. What the hell is that? Swiss Army penis. Well, Quagmire, that's incredible. Peter? Well, yours are made of a stronger metal. We're gonna have to go with the acetylene torch penis. Don't, don't look right at it. My STDs help it burn brighter. The keys are in the ignition. Let's go. I told you to search that guy's penis. You say that about everybody. How did you get a hernia? Actually, I got it performing an incredible act of heroism. Oh, my God! Somebody help me! I'm sinking! <laughs> Hurry! I can't hold it! Okay, let me just unstrap my baby! Oh, 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 slipping, slipping, sorry! You're as bad as those predators on the Internet! That's wild, Stacy. I'm a 12-year-old girl, too. My name's Jenny. Want to come over to my place and help me move? Hey, you're not a 12-year-old girl. Neither are you, Jenny. Huh. I guess we aren't so different after all. Yeah. You know, this isn't a whole lot of stuff. We can probably... When I set my mind to something, anything's possible. That's how I got myself on The Voice. I'm doing this for my mother, who taught me to sing when I was only seven. She was my biggest inspiration, and she was... Taken from me when I was 12, in a fatal car accident. She was my rock, my beacon. And this one, this one's for her. So tell me what you want, what you really, really want. I'll tell you what I want, what I really, really want. I promise it'll never happen again. I hope not, Mrs. Stevens, because next time we won't just take him away. We'll kill him. Uh, let's see, Stanley Starkweather Stevens. So this is where babies come from? Yes, Chris, this is where babies come from. You told me I came out of your vagina! Yeah, or a T-Rex trying to masturbate. All right, internet porn, check. Tissues, check. Lotion, check. Okay, let's go. Aw. <laughs> And that's why they were such vicious killers. Oh, he couldn't masturbate because his arms are too short. They feared him from Kilpatrick down to Galway Bay Port. Luckily, he found a wife so he could have sex. The non-masturbating Tyrannosaurus Rex. Your dog wrote an insensitive tweet. You can't eat here. Uh-oh, Meg. It's a sensitivity mob. It was just a joke. There's no such thing as jokes anymore. Yeah, we live in a post-joke world. Chris, maybe we should just eat outside? No, Meg, we're eating here. I'd like to see you try. Come get the food. I have always wanted to do this. Oh, here are the marsupials. <laughs> Peter, what the hell are you doing? Look at me, Lois. I'm rude. <laughs> Come on, Ma. Let's go watch Pooh trick the bees out of their honey by pretending he's a rain cloud. What if I helped you get a girl? Really? Y y you think you could do that? Sure. All we gotta do is get you a little fixed up. You know, get your hair cut, give you good clean... Ah! 
shave, maybe some cologne. The chicks will be all over you. Gee, you, you really think so? Absolutely. <laughs> oh! Oh, yes! Yes! Oh, oh, hang on a second. What if I helped you get a girl? Really? You, you, you think you could do that? Sure. All we got to do is get you a little fixed up. You know, get your hair cut, give you good clean... Ah! Shave, maybe some cologne. The chicks will be all over you. Gee, you, you really think so? Absolutely. <laughs> Please, just make this stop. Good. Yeah, can you give me a ride to the... Yeah! What is that thing? Yeah! I want to have intercourse with you. Uh, ooh, yeah, intercourse with you. Relations. Intercourse with you. I'm holding on to a dream. A dream of being a dancer. For years I trained, and one day, I finally got my big audition at the Quahog Ballet. I was the best dancer in town, and I knew it. But then, tragedy struck. I slipped and fell. Because someone had pooped in the street. What the literal deuce? I'd broken my leg. After all that training, I would never be in the Nutcracker. And I got the part. Yes, the part meant for me. Everything went according to plan, except for one detail. I only came here to kill her. How did you know she'd be here? Funny thing about that. I got a friend at the harbor who owed me one. Thanks, pal. Anytime, Mac. I felt like I had a void in my life, like like there was a secret hole in me. Oh, God! And I was trying to fill that hole with all kinds of expensive objects and things. Oh, God! And I felt wonderful with all those things filling that hole. Oh, God! I did this to myself, so I'm just gonna have to lay back and let the penal system teach me a lesson. That one is also sexual. Head back to my place, grab a bite to eat, and watch the big curling match on TV. Canada's in the world final against Mexico. No, 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 no! Glenn. This exercise should help teach you self-control. Here's this month's Victoria's Secret catalog. Oh, oh God, oh, God. Uh, 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 dead kittens, dead kittens. Uh, uh, old nuns, uh, really old nuns. Uh, Renee Zellweger. Oh, there we go. Ooh, you got some pie, huh? Can I have a piece? Uh, sure. Ooh, let me have some of that Cool Whip. What'd you say? You can't have a pie without Cool Whip. Cool Whip? Cool Whip, yeah. You mean Cool Whip? Yeah, Cool Whip. Cool Whip. Cool Whip. Cool Whip. Cool Whip. You're saying it weird. Why are you putting so much emphasis on the H? What are you talking about? I'm just saying it. Cool Whip. You put Cool Whip on pie. Pie tastes better with Cool Whip. Say Whip. Whip. Now say Cool Whip. Cool Whip. Cool Whip. Cool Whip. Cool Whip. Cool Whip. You're eating hair! 664-826-1035549. Okay, 664-82... What, what's the rest? Here, let me have Tommy Two-Tone sing it for you. Six six four eight two six one zero three five five four nine six six four eight. May I help you? Yes, nineteen fifties doctor. Me and my friends are looking for your friends with a negro and a cripple. This man is insane. Take him away. Right. Now wait a second. You can't do that to a him. negro speaking up to a white person. This man is insane. <laughs> <laughs> Now, look, I don't think... All cripples are insane. Euthanize this man. Ugh. Something I can help you with? Yeah, you got any brain-dead women in there you let people have sex with for a few bucks? Sure, come on back. Did you like that game of mysterious intruder, Lois? I told you, I don't know who you are, and my name isn't Lois. Mine is. Do it again. Hi, I'm Peter Griffin. Meg's wedding took up a little more time than we would have liked this week, so we didn't get to do everything we wanted to with my hands. So here's a super cut of me having a little fun around town. We like it a lot. We hope you will, too. Go, go, go! Alegría 
Macarena, que tu cuerpo es para la alegría y cosas buenas. Shepard, what's it gonna take to get Meg into a college? If Meg has any chance at all, she's going to need a little extra help. Oh, we'll do anything, whatever it takes. Good. Now you do understand how this works. We understand. I guess I'll, uh, I'll meet you in the car. He didn't mean you have to sleep with him. There are a few options. Now where's my chicken parm from last night? Oh, I, uh, I ate it. You ate it? Yeah, there was no name on it. It was just sitting there. Is there a problem? No. No. No problem. Peter, I'm home from the market. I got steak sandwiches on ciabatta. Oh, that's way better than chicken parm. I'm going to have it with my last can of cream soda. Uh, actually, I finished that, too. That's okay, Brian. Let's take a ride and get some at the grocery store. Pull over here, I gotta take a leak. Leave the gun. Take the cream soda. Where are you going? Oh, I'm meeting up with someone from my grinder app. Isn't that for anonymous gay hookups? No, 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 this one's a way for guys who enjoy sandwiches to connect. You meatball freak? Uh-huh. All right, let's do this. Are you also married? If I wanted to hear a black guy ramble like a lunatic, I'd watch Family Feud. Yeah, I mean, that was worse than an Italian guy describing someone's sexuality. Anyway, my brother Louie, he's, uh, he's a little off to the side, you know? Uh, foofy. Uh, up to the knuckle. He's, uh, he's a backwards mechanic. He likes to play in... Is Netflix streaming the right choice for you? Well, if you like movies in HD, then Frozen Pixels, then HD again, the answer is yes. And if you love the golden year of movies, 2003, then we might have some of what you're looking for. Netflix streaming. Buffer for 20 minutes, then watch 35 minutes of a movie with Jason Statham. Oh, don't be an idiot. Vaping is just as bad, and you look like a douchebag. No, I don't. I look cool. Go ahead. Hold it to your mouth. Oh my god, I'm a douchebag! <laughs> it's okay, Chris. Your secret's safe with me. You think Morgan Fairchild has a fart hole in her house? Morgan, the cuckoo van is divine. But so rich. Will you excuse me? Where do our Hollywood farts go? I've heard they're filtered into Tom Sizemore's house. <laughs> ah, Morgan. Man, I haven't made money this easy since I invented the yanking. Peter, what's wrong? Well, I want to masturbate, but I'm just so darn cold. Too bad there's no answer for that problem. But now there is. Hi, I'm Peter Griffin, creator of the yanking. If you're anything like me, the number one problem in your life is that you can't masturbate just anywhere. But now you can. Introducing the Yankin, the only blanket with built-in decoy arms. Our patented process makes it look like you're holding the remote or sipping a beer. Meanwhile, your real hands are under the blanket going to town. Peter, what are you doing? Nothing. Let's watch a Scarlett Johansson movie. But wait, there's more. We have Yankits for all occasions, sporting events, at the supermarket, on the job. Hey. What's going on under that blanket? You'll never know. We now return to the Terminator. I've been sent here from the future. I have to have sex with your housekeeper to save humanity. What? Bring me your housekeeper. I have to have sex with her now. I'm the Terminator. I don't have a housekeeper, and I think you're just present-day Arnold Schwarzenegger. No, I am a machine. Every second I'm not having sex with a housekeeper. Robots are killing people in the future. Okay, I finished for the day. You lied to me. You do have a housekeeper. Let's go make a large-faced boy. What the hell's going on back there? Remember, each pill has to go into the correct bottle. Eh, this ain't so hard. I 
wicked boner. Wow, look at him go! You know, just when I thought he couldn't get any cooler, he blows. Holy shit! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh, uh, what? What? Just, there's almost nothing left of him! And I just know I'm gonna be the one to have to identify the body. That's him. Poor guy. He looks like a bowl of tomato soup. Guy next to him died in a fire. He looks like a grilled cheese sandwich. Oh, these two poor souls are the best combination for a rainy Saturday. Okay, now add 20. Okay. Now multiply it by 4. Okay. And what do you got? 8,008. And what does 8,008 look like on a calculator? Oh, boob! Boob, yeah! All right, all right, all right, boob! What if we had two calculators and we put them next to each other? <gasps> yes, 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 find one, yes! Here, we each seem to have acquired superpowers from that nuclear waste. We've been given a gift. And whether that gift is Chris's fire conjuring, Stewie's telekinesis, Brian's super speed... Ask me how the Queen of England is. How's the Queen She's of... She's great. Peter's morphing ability... <laughs> Hey, Lois, I'm a wishing troll. <laughs> My super strength. Or Meg's, um, super amazing ability to grow her fingernails. We have a responsibility to use these powers properly and not to abuse them for personal gain. Understand? Yes. Yep. Yes. Mm -hmm. Got it. Well, if we're gonna hide out here in Asian Town, we have to find a place to live. Yes, and we should do nothing to draw attention to ourselves as outsiders. Oh, my God, it's Jackie Chan! Oh my god, it's Jackie Chan! Oh my god, it's Jackie Chan! Hi there, always nice to meet a fan of my movies. Oh my god, you're Ethan Hawke! Uh, no I'm not. Sorry, my mistake. Oh my god, it's Ethan Hawke! Mom, can we go get some food? Oh my god, it's Malcolm in Middle! I'm not a boy! Yes, you are! Yeah, Peter's not exactly the most understanding guy when it comes to you and other men. Like that time at the movies? Ah, that Hugh Grant is so handsome. Oh, is that how it is? Come here, you home-wrecking bastards! <laughs> Don't do it, Dad! He's bigger than you! Mom, why do I have to take a bath with Stewie? Because, Meg, Estelle told me that someone in the family was in danger of drowning and that I should take some steps to prevent it. So from now on, everybody has a bath buddy. Hey, Meg, watch. <laughs> <laughs> Ah! Well, son, you played good, but your dad is still number one. Yeah, I don't think I'll ever beat you. Hey, Chris, what's with your leg? Oh, my God, that's not your leg! What's wrong, honey? I'll tell you what's wrong. I'm trying to make love to you when you're thinking about Chris. Peter, is there something you need to tell me? Thanks to you, our son has a huge wang. Thanks to me? Well, he didn't get it from me. What are you talking about? I'll show you. All right, stand back, Lois. Oh, my. Well, no wonder he's always slouching. How the hell did this happen? I'm supposed to be the man of the house. You must be so ashamed of me. Oh, Peter, I care as much about the size of your penis as you care about the size of my breasts. Oh, my God. Hey, who's the new dude? Oh my god, that's Meg Griffin! She just got out of prison! Hey Meg, what'd they put you in jail for? Being ugly? <laughs> <laughs> hey Meg, what happened? Did you get out early for fat behavior? <laughs> <laughs> nice tattoo! Did you get your butt hair braided too while you were in there? <laughs> <laughs> what'd you do, carve a gun out of soap and then not wash with it? Haha, <laughs> P.U. <laughs> Hey, Meg, are you going to take those soda cans to the Shaw Skank Redemption Center? <laughs> Who was that? Oh, uh, prank call! Oh, yeah, I uh, get a lot of those. I can never figure out who it is. Who is this? Wheelie, wheelie, stupid head. Bet you wished that you were dead. Listen, I don't know who this is, but you better cut it out. I'm a cop, you know. Oh, what, are you going to report me on your can't walkie-talkie? We're in the tub. Before we begin, Chris Griffin has an announcement for the cool kids. Yeah, hey, guys. The meeting of the cool kids club will be at 315, leaning up against Tim Breckner's SUV in the parking lot.
Would you do me? I'd do me. I'd do me so hard. Hey, Chris. What's that? Did you sit on something? Hey, you hoi, hey, why? Hey, 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 Chris Griffin's a freak! What a loser! Hey, is your refrigerator running? Yes, it is. Are your doors unlocked? You... What? Why? I don't know. They all kind of look the same. What do you mean, they all look the same? I'll be as irresistible to her as wood is to a woodchuck. Mom, Dad, I've done a lot of thinking, and I've decided I don't want to go into the family business. I want to be a doctor. Hmm. Let's try that on for size. How much disease could a woodchuck doctor cure if a woodchuck doctor could cure disease? Is that sounding right to you? No. Hey, Jimmy? Yeah, Dad? Next time, if you have an idea, run it through the test before you embarrass yourself. Peter, you better get out of here before I start saying sir like a cop. But come on, Joe, I... Sir, I... sir, you've been asked to leave. Joe, it's me, Peter. Sir! I... I don't want to have to ask you again. Please leave. All right, fine. Sir! No, Joe, Joe, he's leaving. Sir! Joe, Joe. Sir! He's gone. Sir! It's okay. Sir! He's gone. I have milked all the goats. Peter, all those goats are males. Well, the buckets are full and the goats are happy. I just hope word doesn't get around. I like good times. Sorry, Stewie. Wall Street is a people-eat-dog world. Everyone knows that. Oh, my God! Brian, you've turned into a monster! Hey, that's offensive to the monster community. Yeah, some of us are nice. Yeah, real nice. Weren't you charged with sexually abusing a 16-year-old? Elmo's accuser recanted and admitted the relationship was consensual. Yeah, but wasn't there another case that was only thrown out because the statute of limitations had expired? Elmo, no comment. Cookie! Ah, oh, he wants a cookie. Oh, I love the Muppets. I want to be the one to delete the crown. She never watched them. She just had them. Do it, son. Well, 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 the crown. How the tables have turned. Remember this face? The one that wanted to watch Modern Family? Well, payback's a bitch. Delete! Are you sure you want to delete the crown? Yes! Do you understand that it's really good? Yes! Are you sure? It will impress your friends. Except! You understand that we change the cast every season. Acknowledge! Come on, it's the crown, it's history. Don't care! You are not allowed to delete the crown. We now return to the crown. I actually kinda love it. Yeah, me too. It's cause I'm trash and I love how fancy it is. Recognize him, Brian? No. It's your brother. I found him for you, buddy. What? Jerry? What's that big thing around his neck? Oh, I'll show you. <laughs> ah! Oh, my God! Oh, my God! What, what did you do? I killed him, Brian. And he's the lucky one. He went quickly. There were nine dogs in that litter. Now, are you going to help me get those Hannah Montana tickets? Okay, okay, I'll help you. Excellent. Wait, you managed to hunt down eight dogs that were born years ago on a farm in Texas, and you can't manage to get Hannah Montana tickets? That's what I said! Slow down! I want to get there, but I want to get there alive! Principal Shepard, what's it gonna take to get Meg into a college? If Meg has any chance at all, she's going to need a little extra help. Oh, we'll do anything, whatever it takes. Good. Now you do understand how this works. We understand. I guess I'll, uh, I'll meet you in the car. He didn't mean you have to sleep with him. There are a few options. Should have taken the shot, fat ass. Are you sure he can't see me? Absolutely, Chris. You're 100% safe. Okay, that's him. Number six. Hi. Uh, excuse me, you guys? Uh, yeah, I'm here to pick up my son, Chris Griffin. Uh, he's here to finger the guy who held up that convenience store. I mean, maybe you've seen him. His name is Chris Griffin. 
Oh, wait a second. You know what? I think I got a picture of him somewhere. Here, here you go. Yeah, you can go ahead and hang on to that. I got a ton of them at home. In, in fact, I was going to throw that one out anyway, because Chris messed it up by writing his school schedule and a list of his fears all over the back of it. Wow, are girls coming on to me because my sister died? Cool! God, I wish it was Joe in that box. I do too, bud. Oh, did I say that out loud? No, but at this point, I know what you're thinking. It'll be soon, bud. Come on, Woody. We're gonna search for food. Sorry, Chris. The plant can't come. It's his best friend. Oh, it'll just be another mouth to feed. I'll, I'll take care of Woody, son. What was that? Nothing. Let's go.